Well, hello and welcome back to Persona 3 Portable. We are at school right now and we're going to be, I think we talked to everybody in the room last time. So we're gonna be exploring the school and we're going to be moving on with the story a little bit. But for the most part, this is gonna be a lot of talking. So if you're not interested in that, check the chapters in the description. My parents always nag me to like study for exams and stuff. They're so annoying. I just became a junior. I'm supposed to be having fun. They just came into some money, so they're getting all strict about my future in junk. <laughs> all right, so next to your classroom, I believe there's just other classrooms. There is the PA room across the way, and the student council room is also here if you need it. Uh, for right now, I'm not gonna be checking out any of those places, but in the future, we will. When you were absent, there was an election for student council president. Mitsuru Senpai's speech was so cool. I voted for her. Everyone else looks so small compared to Mitsuru Senpai. Ah, <sighs> Mitsuru Senpai. Um, each of these people who are here for the most part will remain here for the rest of the game and their little dialogue things will increase to or like, will like change and um, their stories will progress. So it's actually kind of like a side piece and it's really easy to miss, but some of their stories are, I mean, they're not like vital to the story, but it's fun to like listen to them talk. School's barely started and there's already been a student who quit. She only had two years left. What'll she, what'll she do if she doesn't even graduate from high school? She said she was going to quit being a high schooler. Well, it's her life, not mine. Let's see, I think this is another classroom and we have the bathrooms down here. For the record, since we missed it the last time uh, because there wasn't really anything that you could like glean from using the restroom. Your mind wanders as you wash your hands. You feel like you could still be better academically. It seems that there are people who you can't become acquainted with unless your academics are high enough. You wonder if you should study more. Okay, if you go quickly to your menu and check your status, your status, not your allies, uh, you can see in the top left, it says academics, charm and, charm and courage, and it's currently one out of six for each. Like all Persona games, we're gonna wanna increase that so we can meet new people and do new things. Um, actually, I think we already talked to her, but if you are interested to know, there are in fact two things you can buy here. The fried bread, which is pretty rare, um, and the yakisoba bread. I think you can only buy these on specific days. I think there's, is there one more that you can buy? I can't remember. Uh, I'm just gonna pick up one of each of those for right now. Nothing super interesting, you do not have to. Over here you have the home economics room, the music room, the science room, the art room, and the laboratory. Though this is kind of weird because it looks like it goes to nothing. Right? Like, does this not look, I think it's supposed to be that this wall, there's like a wall here, but it looks like it goes to nothing. By the way, the sign on the door to the home economics looks like it was written in another language. It's hard to read. It doesn't look like English. And if you listen close, you can hear mysterious voices inside. It's one awfully mysterious home economics class, let me tell you. And this is actually a key, uh, a cute, not cute. This is a, this is a thing. This is the home economics room. You want to check this out. There's a note on the door. It appears to be a mixture of Japanese and some other language. In order for you to understand it, you need to improve your academics. You must be at least average. So there you go. That's one of the things that you have to do. What do you want? I'm using my cell now. Talk to me later, okay? Yeah, fine. Let's see. Let's head over to the first floor hallway on the left side. We've got the faculty office over here and the bulletin board, which if you check out the bulletin board, it'll tell you the dates that things are gonna happen. There's a saying, he who hunts two hares at once will catch neither. That means a student like you who's always trying to do two things at once will, the teacher continues to scold the student. He sounds like he knows what he's saying, doesn't he? Well, listen to this. Last year, he was dating two women at the same time, but the thing is, they worked together. And when they found out, they both dumped him. Ah. Uh. I came here because I'm not feeling too good. I just wanted some cough drops, but he gave me this weird looking medicine. I wasn't in the mood to gather my courage, so I declined. And he busted out another weird medicine that I've never even seen before. Okay, so uh, the faculty office is there, the library is there, the nurse's office is here. We will be back to the nurse's office in the future because we will need to, I think this is one of the last games, it's not in four or five, uh, where you can become sick. And when you become sick, it's actually, um, you can go take medicine to up your courage. And we're gonna be taking advantage of that. Uh, it also affects how you do in Tartarus which is a pain, but we'll, we'll talk more about it when it becomes more relevant. He ran into Junpei at the entrance and decided to go home with him. Hmm? There's a commotion at the front gate. Look! It's Akihiko-senpai! 
on. No, thank you. Wait for us. <sighs> Man, would you look at that? I hear they're always swarming Akihiko Senpai like that. I know he's the captain of the boxing team, but I Is mean, it? come on. You don't even see girls flock like that on TV. I wonder where they're going. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? Yes. Huh? Who? Us? I... I guess so. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be at the police station. See you there. The... the police station? Are we being arrested? Uh, are your friends gonna come along too? Who? These girls? I don't even know their names. They talk so much they give me a headache. Anyway, I'm gonna head out. Don't keep me waiting. Akihiko is not a oh, womanizer. Why can't he be more friendly? <sighs> Man, how can he not know their names? I mean, seriously, just look at them. Well, guess we gotta go. Sheesh. Talk about putting a damper on a guy's afternoon. The police station at the Polonia Mall. You decide to head there with Junpei. We're gonna go straight there after I talk to everybody here. I have the strange feeling that someone's watching me. <sighs> the female student continues to sigh. <laughs> okay. Hey, I read those ghost stories that were being spread around school on the internet. You know, the ones about those students who died became ghosts and ate humans. Wait, how would anybody know they ate humans? There wouldn't be any remains. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. We're going to Hagakure. Uh, that's, um, the ramen place, which we'll get to in a minute. But we're going to head straight to Polonia Mall. We're just going to go straight to the police station because I want to get rid of Junpei. Um, he's kind of annoying. This seems to be the police station. Thank you, sir. Oh, these are the guys I was talking about earlier. This is Officer Kurosawa. He helps keep our squad well equipped. And this is from Ikutsuki-san. Really? Sweet! You and Junpei each received 5,000 yen. No, you do you not get Junpei's number or so money find to something like, you like give him stuff, which is stupid. Officer Kurosawa has connections, but these things still cost money. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. Okay. I realize that. Well, I'll see you later. Thanks again. I've been informed about you too. My job is to maintain peace in this city, regardless of the circumstances. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. I'm only doing what I think is right. Okay, so at this point, I don't have that much, but you should be able to find what you need. Let's go ahead and talk to the guy first. I won't ask what they'll be used for, but I believe that you'll use them for the right reasons. Okay, so he sells things like weapons for each of us. Um, they're all pretty expensive right now and the boost we get from them isn't great, so don't worry too much about that. We can buy some armor here, which is actually a pretty good boost, but also very expensive. And I wanna hold 4,500 of my yen, so really we don't have that much to spend. Um, Armor here increases defense. Shoes usually increase evasion, which actually can be very useful. Uh, accessories here, you have things that will increase your SP, your HP, just various stuff. Nothing that I really want to spend my money on. Also, you can sell stuff here. Um, eventually, we'll be able to sell other things as well. But for right now, eh. Psh, only 5,000 yen. That's 50 bucks. I'm going to take off since I'm in a bad mood now. Later. Okay. Well, now that we're in the mall, let's talk to some people first. Oh my, how did I forget to buy shampoo? No rush, just wait for the sale. Isn't Saturday the sale date at Aohige? Is it Aohige? I can never, oh God. This game is gonna test my Japanese pronunciation of things and it's gonna be awful. This is the only apology you're gonna get. Aohige Pharmacy. Yeah, so the pharmacy is over here and they do have a sale on Saturday, so it's far more important to go there on Saturday rather than on regular days, unless you need to. Ah, uh, hello, say, have you heard anything about this business of ordinary healthy people changing overnight? I haven't heard about it. Hey, you don't sound concerned at all. How can you not know about this? You live here. Oh, I have heard about it, but I don't care at the moment. Everywhere you look, you see young couples. So what are you waiting for? Go after someone. You're still young, you've got no excuse not to be together with some sweetie of your own. We're gonna date everybody. 
I'm gonna have a lot of words. Ooh, I got a thing actually today. Woo -hoo. Um, we're gonna have a lot of words about some of the things that's in this game. I'm gonna rant. <laughs> Are you here for the arcade? If you want to know about the games here, I can tell you all about them. Sure. You can play the quiz game today or try the fortune teller machine. The quiz game is pretty difficult. It's a good way to improve your academics. I'm not sure what goods the fortune teller, the, what good the fortune teller machine does, but I hear you gain some kind of magic powers. Well, that about covers it. So yeah, his kid will tell you about what's going on in the game parade on each day. Um, I don't really care right now. We have Power Records, which is a music store. Uh, we have the pharmacy, which is right here. You can buy various items, such as revival beads and medicine and whatnot. Let's talk to this guy. The competition between different pharmacies is heating up. I've got to make my store more unique or I'll be sunk. I'm starting by making Saturday a regular sale day. Come out this weekend and support my store. Okay, we'll probably, we may or may not do that this time. We have an antique store here. However, it seems to be closed, but it will open back up on June 9th. Uh, up here, we have a karaoke place, uh, which will increase your courage. Back here, we have a back alley. There's a mysterious door and a quiet alley. Yeah, it's the velvet room. So if you want to go to the velvet room outside of Tartarus, there it is. We got the police station, you have a bulletin board. Uh, there's a bulletin board in front of the police box. There's just nothing posted on it right now. We'll check that out later. Blue move B blue five or B blue V. I think it's five. Um, is a healing place that you can increase your condition at from tired to I think great is how far it can go. Uh, you can also work here part time. The Chagall Cafe is another place that you can work, but you can also drink coffee there. I don't remember. Is it to increase your charm? I think you can drink pheromone coffee that will turn on your charm. And you can also come here with people, I believe, occasionally, but we're not gonna be going there. Um, we have Club Escapade that's not open at the moment, so nobody cares. Let's get out of here. Okay, we got the Port Island Station next, which, uh, let's see, the weather is nice today. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Oh, okay, well, that's interesting. Man, school has started. I'm so lazy. Why? Listen. I don't need a reason to be lazy. Besides, everyone gets like this after days off. It's the truth, man. Uh, is it? We got a screenshot movie theater here. Do you like movies? Sure. Me too. Movies kick ass. I love them because they're like little, like, wait, what? I love them because they're like a microcosm of real life. There we go. Got a vending machine here. We got um, flower shop lady. Welcome to... Is it Rafflesia? I'm not sure on that one. Oddly enough, we don't sell Rafflesia is here. Trust me, you wouldn't want one. I think those are the flowers that smell bad, aren't they? The best part of the station is its size and how close it is to the ocean. We're proud of it. I personally like it a lot. What about you? Sure, it's good. Wonderful. I'm glad you like it. Okay, let's see. Then we got the strip mall here. Um, let's start over here. We've got this place here. Hi there. Our takoyaki is delicious and it's only 400 yen. It's our own special recipe with no octopus. Want some? Uh, no thank you. Aw, uh, you're not gonna buy any? Let's see. My friend has a cat and it's so cute. I want one too, but my mom hates animals. We've got the wild duck burger. Uh, we have a mystery burger and the ingredients are a secret. You need a little bit of courage to eat here. Um, we're not gonna stay here, but uh, that's a thing, apparently. Bookworms used books. Closed for termite extermination. We will reopen on 425, so three days from now. As you can see, I'm just a salary man. I'm not just skipping work. Oh. <laughs> sure. Let's go to the second floor. Uh, this one's a little bit less interesting. We've got a vending machine. Uh, we've got a restaurant here. Progeny Platter. Get smarter while you digest. Um, we're not gonna stay here, but you can up your academics there. We've got the ramen place. Uh, you can eat pork ramen here, which will make your skin beautiful, apparently. Um, which will up your charm. We're not interested in that. We've got a sweet shop here. A sweet scent is drifting out the door. Nothing of interest. We've got the beef bowl shop upstairs. It's too crowded right now. It's very rare that you'll go there. And we got book on. Manga are stacked up to the ceiling. Okay, and we've got a vending machine. So nothing of interest there that I really care about. Um, I don't think, oh, let's go to the station. This is easy to miss. I envy you students, it's a new term for you guys. But for cabbies like me, it's the same thing. Year in, year out. 
Uh, you okay? I'm not feeling bad or nothing, just... I feel like I've done it all before, you know? Every year. Hmm, I see. I have a new teacher, but he's, um... We're already a little into the first term, and it still feels weird to be in the room with him. Why? It's like he doesn't talk at all, even during lunchtime. I'm a sixth grader, I'll be moving on next year, and I'm stuck with a teacher like this. He's basically just... just talks. Countless pamphlets have been posted on the phone booth. Huh, interesting. Got another vending machine. Um, nothing else of interest there. We have a shrine. Not much here. Uh, we've got the water looks crystal clear. Um, we just have basic shrine stuff, which is a huge tree over here, like the divine tree. This is where you wash your hands, I think. I've seen or heard that people like swish their mouth too, but I wouldn't do that. We've got some Inari sushi over here. Um, when you join hands and wish in front of the small shrine, you can give away one of your skill cards and receive two in return five days later. We're not going to be doing that, um, right now. We got a box here, which you can, um, by leaving money in the offertory box, your academics will increase. If you're in great condition, the increase will be even higher. Time will pass. We're not going to be do that today. And we have a fortune box over here, which is under repairs, but eventually we will be able to use that to do stuff with our relationship. Okay. So today I'm gonna just hold on buying anything and I'm gonna head over to the screenshot. Screenshot movie theater. Screenshot movie theater presents an original program. High school students, 1500 yen. Okay, so today let's go ahead and check what's showing. A movie marathon is playing. Pump up your brain with foreign movies without subtitles. Tickets cost 1500 yen for high school students. Let's go ahead and watch the movie today. You immersed yourself in foreign languages and found yourself unsure if you understood them or not. Your academics has greatly increased. It's getting late. You decide to go back to the dorm. Welcome back. Hey, perfect timing. I'd like to speak to you for a moment. Regarding your exploration of Tartarus, Akihiko is still on the mend, so for now, I'd like you to lead the team. You never know when a powerful enemy might appear like the one you faced the other day. It's best to be prepared or else you may find yourself in a difficult situation. So whenever you'd like to explore Tartarus, just let me know and I'll gather everyone there. Also, since I'm sure there are other things you will need to take care of, you may go out at night if you need to. Well, that's it. Keep up the good work. For the record, um, for the most part, we're going to be just hitting Tartarus like one and done type stuff to just power through it. Um, on specific days so don't worry too much about that but it will it will be relevant he turned on the television who was then immediately sent to the hospital the man has regained consciousness but due to his condition has been unable to speak police are awaiting the man's recovery before questioning him and that's the news for today yes how can i help you uh so you can check everyone's status you can go to tartarus or you just talk those who are unable to experience the dark hour are transmogrified during that time. They appear as coffins. Shadows are quite en enigmatic. They only attack those who have not been transmogrified. Shadows feed on the minds of their victims, leaving them unable to speak. We call this apathy syndrome. And those who suffer from this incapacitating affliction are known as the lost. How shadows came into this world is still a mystery. I used to be a researcher for Carrijo Electronics. That is the primary reason why I'm the chairman of the board. And that is also what makes this dormitory such a convenient location to conduct seas activities. Oh, you should also be aware that I'm unable to summon personas. However, in order to perform my research, I was taught how to enter the dark hour. So if you need any help, please do not hesitate to ask. Of course, I cannot be of any help. <laughs> oh God. Officer Kurosawa doesn't have the potential to enter the dark hour. He's just an ordinary policeman. But he knows about us and helps out when he can. Um, so why does he help? To be honest, I don't really know. But he's a police officer, so he's dedicated his life to helping people. Plus, he's a pretty cool guy. Uh, let's ask him the other one. Uh, how did you meet him? He helped me out a while ago. He's someone you can count on. Hmm. I get pretty tired after we go to Tartarus. I feel like I just spent all day hiking up Mount Fuji. What about you, Katone? Uh, I feel tired too. Yeah, it's tough, especially for girls. I think we just have to get used to it. Hey, you know that thing we use to summon our personas, the evoker? Well, I was thinking, why does it have to look like a gun? I mean, you gotta be a little nutty to point a gun at your head and pull the trigger, you know? 
Um, it's to experience death. That's literally what it is. Okay, let's head to the command room real quick here. There are many files labeled as shadow appearance dates. They are stamped with a do not remove label. Interesting. It's a bank of consoles. You don't know how to use it, but it seems very advanced. Eventually we will be able to come up here and use the console to encounter things and see things. Uh, let's see here. Let's head back to the town map. And really we only have one place that we can go at night because everything else is closed. Do you have anything else to say? No, uh, yeah, I know about it. Well, obviously it's all over TV. Okay, uh, so things like Club Escapade are actually open now. Hmm, I feel a strange aura around you. In my mind, I see visions, people's past, present, and future. For most people, I see clearly and far ahead. But you are different. Your future is filled with both blinding light and stagnant shadow. I can see but a small portion. What lies beyond that is shrouded in mystery. What a peculiar fate you carry. Now, young lady, bearer of light and shadow, if you wish to know more about the near future, come and talk to me. I will share my limited visions with you. Now tell me, would you like to know your fortune? Uh, sure. Very well. You have pulled fate's trigger. The bullet passes through many, heading directly to its target. What target that may be, however, is unknown to me. You must find that out for yourself. Farewell then, may your future be bright. I've known that girl since we were in elementary school together. She loves fortune telling stuff. She used to pull out these weird props from her bag. She claimed they were her lucky charms. Ugh. Do you believe in fortune telling? Mm, I'm not sure. You should take it more seriously. I don't mean to say it comes true all the time, but sometimes. Do you need something? Oh, are you looking for company? Sorry, but you'll have to take a number. I already have so many chicks waiting for me. Just wait your turn until another day, okay? I think you end up rejecting that guy ultimately, and it's funny to me. Nothing's happening nowadays. I guess that's what peace means. How about you? Anything happening in your life? Uh, yeah. I see. Sounds tough. Well, good luck with whatever it is. There will be a specific person here eventually. Um, he's not here today, but he is a reference to another game. Hey, what do you have? Uh, aren't you a little too young to be in here? Well, I guess you can stay. Just don't cause any trouble, all right? And um, there will be a social link in here later as well. Anyway, uh, that's basically all we've got here. So let's head to the game parade. Various arcade games are inside. And we're gonna go ahead and stay here. Right now, the games available to play are the quiz game, which costs 3,000 yen and the lucky fortune. We're gonna play 3,000 yen, pay 3,000 yen to play the academics game. You tested your mastery of trivia against players from all over Japan. Your academics has greatly increased. It is getting late. You decide to go back to the dorm. Man, I'm so tired. Coming to school is a job by itself. Things got so busy all of a sudden. Well, I do feel a lot more satisfied though. Uh, but we're just starting. You sure you're gonna be okay? You better not get sick from pushing yourself too hard. Oh man, I'm getting teary-eyed now. Going to class is a pain. The only thing I look forward to is after school. How will I kill time? Jubi came over to talk to you in the moment class ended. Yo, mind hanging out with me after this? I know some place that's really good. It'll be my treat. Come on, let's go. All right. All right, now you're talking. Uh, you can choose anything you want here. Iwa Todai Strip Mall, Hagakure Ramen. It's crowded, but luckily you were able to get in without much waiting. Hmm, all right, we'll have two specials. Hmm, that sounds good. Well, I'm sure it'll be better than you're expecting. After a few moments, the waiter brings two ramen bowls to you. The fragrant, fragrant smell rising from the bowls makes your stomach growl. Come on, try it. You take a bite. The, dis the distinct taste of the soup blends well with the thick noodles. It's really quite delicious. Hmm, I've never had anything quite like this. Haha, <laughs> good, right? Well then, I'm digging in too. Chow time! Ah, hot, hot, hot. Man, this is great. Although Junpei eats noisily, he seems to be enjoying his ramen. I can't eat at ramen places. Slurping noises bother me. Hey, do you feel okay now? I heard that while you were out for a while, you were in the hospital. You seemed full of energy at school, but I was kind of worried. Um, uh, thanks. Huh? Oh, um, no need to thank me. I had some problems myself when I transferred here too. In your case, you've got all that fighting stuff on top of that. I was wondering if you weren't accustomed to school or whatever. Then again, I think you'll do just fine. Junpei seems embarrassed and laughs. 
You can sense Junpei's thoughtfulness towards you. Thou art I, and I art thou. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Magician Arcana. Oof. You have established the Junpei Iori social link of the Magician Arcana. You may earn an XP bonus when fusing personas of the mag Magician Arcana. Still, girls and guys living in the same dorm? That can't be good. Uh, what are you thinking about? Oh, don't worry about me. I don't drag love into my work. Then again, I can't guarantee that I won't fall for somebody. <laughs> you and Junpei chatted for a while, then headed back. Welcome back. Shiomi, have you been monitoring your condition? Exploring Tartarus can be very tiring. If you use up your stamina exploring the tower, you will be tired for the rest of the next day. So those conditions will vary as well, so make sure you take that into consideration before you begin exploring. Okay, so yeah, you'll become tired and um, it's fine. Your persona is like a part of you. That's why mine only learns physical skills. Because dudes are supposed to fight with their fists, mano a mano. Oh, that's right, I use a sword. <laughs> yes, how can I help you? When exploring Tartarus, it is important to monitor the status of your teammates as well as your own. Teammates who are sick or tired should not be permitted to explore the tower. If you're around people who are sick, you might get infected by them. Hmm, I wonder why you don't notice you've been infected until after the battle. Must be because you're concentrating so hard on fighting. Well, anyways, just don't come near me if you get sick. Akihiko! My goodness. You turned on the television. The customers sure were excited to see her like that. Our next story is about the release of the spring carp. Over 10,000 were released into the river this year. The next carp release ceremony will be held in June. Hmm, interesting. Well, I prefer a bow and arrow, probably because I'm in the archery club. What's great about a bow is you don't fall down if an enemy dodges one of your arrows. Although, a bow doesn't do very much damage and it misses a lot. But you can always balance those negatives with your persona. So, no worries. Hmm, interesting. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and head up to your your room at this point. Uh, you can also check here. So uh, we still got a regular place, but that's how you wouldn't check to see what your condition is. Uh, or I think in the status, if you go into your status here, like you can see I'm good currently, but that's, I believe you can check everybody. Good and also good. I think if you're sick, it's red. If you're bad, it's yellow. I don't, I don't even remember. Uh, let's see here. So you, now that we are free to do things, you can now actually study at your desk, which I'm going to do. You've decided to study. Your academics has increased. We're gonna be working heavily on academics for a bit. You overhear a conversation. Is it just me or have there been more weird people around lately? You're talking about the apathy syndrome, right? My neighbor has that, it grosses me out. Sometimes I think I might have it too and it depresses me. Maybe you just need to get some exercise. Hey, the athletics teams are accepting new members. Maybe I should join. The first bell has rung. All right. It seems that certain athletic teams are still recruiting. If you can find the appropriate room, you might be able to join. We're not doing that today. And I think we have some conversation with folks. I hear that some of the athletic teams are recruiting new members. Just the volleyball team and the tennis team though. The others are full. Okay, so I think most of these guys have um, all pretty much the same conversation for now. So uh, just a heads up on that. Let's see, I wanna actually go down to the first floor. Wait, no, uh, you know what, this is fine. <laughs> I went the wrong direction, but it's fine. Oh, hey, and also I completely forgot about this. There is actually an area out here where there is a persimmon tree. A small tree is growing here. You wonder what kind of tree it is. The tree seems special for some reason. I wonder why it's there. Does it commemorate something? Uh, we'll be talking about that uh, later. Uh, let's see, there's an indoor pool here, a gymnasium, and the field. I'm not gonna be going out to any of those things, but just a heads up that they are actually, uh, they're actually there. Let's see, what's the best way to get to the main floor from here? 
Um, not this direction, apparently. I'm actually not great. Oh, you can go to the main lobby like this. I'm actually not great for um, like doing stuff. Uh, we want to buy a Yon Be Gone here if you don't have one. I don't think I've picked one up yet. Here. But we do actually want to make sure that we buy one of those while we were here because we will need it. Uh, you're new. He's so hot. Don't you think so too? Man, he's so hot. I don't... Are we talking about this kid? Hey, I think that chick's checking me out. Oh yeah, man, she's definitely checking me out. Is this the same? This isn't the same ones that were out here, was it? I guess it was. Yeah, it's hard to tell. I don't have a great um, guide on like all the people who like move around and the conversation changes. So I'll probably just talk to people for a little bit and uh, it'll be fine. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, we're gonna either be joining volleyball or tennis today, but for now, since it's been half an hour of doing this, I'm gonna save and next time we're gonna be joining a sport and then we're gonna be heading into Tartarus. So I will see you guys next time.